I'm Greg Arben, Schools Manager here at Wigan Athletic Community Trust. The last couple of days um, we've had show races and Red Card here with us, a really good partner of ours, we've been used for a number of years. Um, we've done a primary schools event yesterday and a secondary schools event today, part of our Inspires project, um, just talking about racism, discrimination, and it's always inside. We take them through an anti-racism workshop where we talk to them about stereotype and how stereotype will lead to judging and again their worldview could influence some of these things as well and how it could potentially lead to, being, uh, to racism. And then we look at hate crime workshop where we look at what hate crime is, uh, what characteristic the characteristics are or the groups of people that could be affected by hate crime and also we look at um, how we could potentially report hate crime and when we put them through activities like the change makers activities where we give them some of the problems and then these young people come up with solutions for the problem. For example, if teachers don't know much about racism, what could they potentially do in their schools to help these teachers know and engage more about racism? And you see some of them come up with brilliant ideas like setting up anti-racism assembly, uh, assemblies, setting up workshops and bringing show racism red card into schools to talk more about racism, and then setting up anti-racism club or anti-discriminatory club. So, so many brilliant ideas. And we just came to answer a few questions, uh, give our experiences, and kind of just put a face to um, some of the situations that they, they've been through. I think it's important sometimes when you're just looking at things on paper or on the screen, um, you kind of lose that humanity to it. So um, me and Omar coming in and kind of giving our experiences, giving our thoughts and also showing that it's not just we're footballers, we're also human beings too. I think it's a good way to start and uh, hopefully they go and express those things to their friends and family and uh, take the right path. It's always brilliant when we come here. It's always brilliant because um, not just a workshop, it's the, the community trust as well, it's the impact, the way they manage to put these events. <clears throat> Last time we had one, every year we have one, but this year we have two. And I'm hoping that this partnership lasts longer and we have more events to put together just to reach out to more young people and impact our society in a positive way.